Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use images from Wikipedia and put them into Wikivet, which I'm sure you can imagine would be quite useful. So, first off, we'll go to a page in Wikivet, and in this example I'm going to use a page from the um, page called Viral Replication within Wikivet. And you can see here we've got some information on how viruses replicate, got the different stages and we've got a few images here but I want to see if there's anything um, better within Wikipedia any images that I might be able to use and there's a few considerations that we have to think about and I'll talk you through those so first off I'll go to Wikipedia and look for virus and we'll see what we get and you can see we've got a page here about viruses within Wikipedia and one that's caught my eye is this one here on the right. I think it's really colourful, it seems to show the different stages quite logically, so it's showing the virus coming in on the left hand side, moving through the different stages within the cell, and then you can see lots more viruses have been released on the right hand side. And to check whether or not I can use this in Wikivet, I need to find out the copyright status of this image. So what I'm going to do is click on the image here. And you see I go to an information page. At the moment this information page is still within Wikipedia. You can tell that by looking at the logo. So I'm still within Wikipedia here. But if I scroll down I can find out about the copyright status. And here under licensing you can see that this image has been created by its author as part of the Wikipedia project. And he's effectively released this. Um, it has no copyright. So he said anybody can use it for any purpose and there's no conditions. Okay, So this is um, really useful for us to be able to use then. The easiest way to then take this from the page is to go to its this, um, the actual page for it within Wikimedia Commons and that's where all the information about this image will be stored. So to get there I'm going to click onto the description page link which is just here and once I click there you see now the logo's changed. Now I'm in Wikimedia Commons. Okay? And this has got a handy link here saying use this file on a wiki on the right hand side. So what I'm going to do is click onto there and it gives me two links I can choose from. Um, actually I'm going to take the bottom one because I think I'm going to want this image quite large. So I'm going to click onto there and it's highlighted. I'm copying that now by pressing Ctrl and C. And what I'm now going to do is put that link within the Wikivet page. And I want to put this right at the bottom of the page down here. So what I'm going to do is click on Edit at the top of the page. And I'm going to scroll down through the code on the page till I get right to the end. Okay, So I've got a blank space here just above this category page. And all I have to do is paste in the code there. So I've just done Control and V and that's pasted in. I can first off see how that looks, so if I click show preview I can see what the image looks like. So I scroll down and that's how big the image is. And I think that looks pretty good so I'm going to leave it like that. But bef the essential thing here now, because I'm just in the preview, I have to click on save page. And I'm going to put in a description of what I've done, so inserted image from Wikipedia. I'm going to click save page and now this image is actually on the page and if you click onto this image we're then taken to the information from um, all about this page but you can see this information now is within Wikivet and it's all exactly the same um, entry that was from Wikipedia and Wikimedia Commons. So you don't have to copy all of this, you don't have to rewrite the description, you don't have to enter in the copyright status, it does that automatically for you. So hopefully you'll be able to use um, this technique to find copyright free images that you can use. Um, if in doubt and you're not sure if you can use the image, please just don't use it, um, otherwise you could get in trouble. Um, with copyright laws. If you're in doubt and you're not sure then you can always ask the Wikivet team so if you email us wikimaster at wikivet.net then we would tell you if you can or can't use the image. So hopefully you'll have some fun with those and we'll see some good images in there. Thank you.